Okay, Red Hook. Uh, from what we've seen, it sounds like uh, not a lot of you have seen very good movies. So every couple weeks or so, maybe a month or so, we're going to add movies to this list. And this list is going to be called Movies to Watch Before You Die. And to start out this list, I'm going to say Back to the Future. Because a lot of you haven't seen Back to the Future, and you're all collectively breaking my heart, including you. And just watch it. It's awesome, it's funny, and it has to be one of my favorites. 1.21 gigawatts! Great Scott! Another must-see movie is The Princess Bride. It's, like, so hilarious, and it has really great pickup lines, and once you watch it, like, you will never get tired of watching it again and again and again. It's just super, super good. Ah, that Phoebe, she really can fuss. Fuss, fuss. I think she just likes to scream at us. Probably. Mm. She means no harm. Yes, but she's short on charm. Stop crying. I need it. Anybody want a peanut? Now, if you're worrying about pickup lines, uh, no, look no further than Top Gun, because Tom Cruise, how could you say no to what he does in the movie? That'll be the clip. But the movie is extremely quotable. Yeah, people are like, oh, I don't like this movie because blah, blah, blah. No, this movie's amazing. It's got Tom Cruise, it's got Val Kilmer. It's incredibly 80s. But there's nothing else I can say. Uh, excuse me, miss? Uh, don't worry, I got this. Are you guys doing this thing from Top Gun? Okay, Inside Out is another really great movie. Um, like, you will leave the theater having cried at least once because there are so many just really emotional moments and the like, soundtrack just ties in and just with the moment and you're like, eh, but it's just, it's really good and you should watch it. It's like one of the best Pixar movies I've seen. Pixar's generally pretty good though, so. Who's your friend that likes to play? Bing bong. For my last movie, for at least th this episode of my last movie, I'm gonna go with another Tom Cruise movie, Collateral. It's not a comedy, but Tom Cruise plays a villain, and it's actually really good. He plays a hitman, he has to get rid of like five people in one night, and he kidnaps Jamie Foxx to be his cab driver. And the entire movie is just awesome. It has young Mark Ruffalo, and I don't know what, what else to say. I love the soundtrack. Chris Cornell appears in it, and he's also in Casino Royale, another one of my favorites. You killed him! I shot him. The bullets in the fall killed him. I'm gonna have to see Collateral too, because I've never seen it before, either. It seems like I didn't see the Back to the Future or Collateral. I'm just, I, I really have a lot of movies, I guess, that I have to see before I die. Um, the next movie that I would say is a must-see is Dead Poet Society. It's a really, really good movie. Um, just, it has... Robin Williams? Robert Williams in it. And uh, it's he's, he's like really awesome in it. And it's, it's just like, it's a movie that I think everybody in their own way can relate to. And um, it's also will make you cry. But the ending is just spot on. So, that is another movie you should go see, and here's the clip. You know what? Comic Core sticks. I'm captain by captain! Uh, so, Red Hook, that was six movies to see before you die. There will be more coming eventually, but eventually. Now, back to the anchors. Yeah.